Yo, 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 what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another edition of Manga After Dark. <laughs> Alright, what's good, y'all? Hope your holidays are going well. Uh, however you uh, celebrate the holidays, hope it's going well. Be able to spend time with your family, your loved ones, and all that good stuff. Get those good presents, good food, good time. Hope y'all doing well. So One Piece chapter 1070. Jesus, it's been 1070 chapters of One Piece. It's just that number that sounds crazy. And thank you for reacting it with me. Uh, so my schedule got wonky because uh, I was running errands yesterday. So we're here now. So let's dive right into that chapter. So see the color. We still have all these new. Uh, they're not, I guess, new anymore. Uh, all the current like protagonists and all the different shonen manga. I need to catch up on all of these series or start some of them. Like Jesus Christ, I don't even know who like most of these people are. All right, so One Piece chapter one thousand and seventy, the most powerful beings. Okay, no, <laughs> Terma sixty six, Cold Blood Voyage, Volume twenty seven, promising scientists gathering for the uh, sake of the world and all mankind. Yo. This, that's clearly Judge. So that's Vegapunk. He has a bandy on his head. That's Caesar. And he had antlers even back then. And who's that? Is that Queen? Yo, is that Queen? That's pretty dope. And there's someone um, with the hat with their back turned. It's a female. Uh oh. Uh oh, mystery character. All right, so let's dive right into the chapter. Kiata! So Sentamaru hits the ground. Sentamaru struck down. Battle axe! Said Luffy's running in his gear fifth mode. Sorry, I didn't mean to distract you. Miss Sentamaru, don't underestimate me. I saw his attack coming, moron. I thought I. That, that speed! I thought I blocked. So Sentamaru used his barrier hockey, and Luchi like bypassed it. So then Luchi, you're tough, but I need you out of the picture. You outrank us in the command hierarchy. As long as you're conscious, we can't use the Seraphim. So Luchi's charging at uh, Sentamaru, and Sentamaru's trying to block it again. Gum gum. Luffy pieced his ass up! Gum gum. Booming white. Alright, so kanji used means white, but the kana sounds like classic. Dawn. Sound effects used for grand moments. It also can be. It also can be sound. Sound. It also can sound like dawn, gum, 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 booming white. Whip, and he just sends Luchi flying. Damn, gum, gum, booming white whip. And Luchi goes crashing into the ground. Whoa! And Luffy's spinning like a tornado. All right, okay. So Luffy winds himself up like a like a. He winds himself up. He punched Luffy and he grabbed him and spun him and threw him down. Because Luffy's like spinning in a tornado. Whoa, I can't sl uh, slow down. Then we got the other CP0 agents. Luchi! Chopper's running with uh, Bonnie. Hurry, Luffy. We've got to get us get to Vegapunk fast if we have, to have any hope of saving this kid. Then Luffy, I spun too hard. I can't slow down. Then Chopper, huh? Where are you going, Luffy? And Luffy's just going, he's spinning in the opposite direction. Ah! Typical Luffy. Take shelter in the factory. Then it's, uh, then it's, uh, then it's, uh, a hawk. The S hawk. Then we got S shark is like making the ground, uh, wavy and all the agents are falling. They're unstoppable. And if that isn't bad enough, we'd still lose if we found a way to destroy them. It's even more terrifying when you remember they're still just children. Vegapunk, that's the power I'm talking about. So Frankie is crying. The one uh, the scrimpy version of Jinbei is using, it's the Strimson Fruit, right? That belo that power belongs to Senior Pink, my sworn brother from the Don Quixote family. Only one person can have a fruit power at that time. So did he bite the dust? So Frankie's crying. That's a real yeah yeah it's a real question. So you notice that man is currently in in that inmate impaled down, Frankie, huh? 
Wait, are you saying you made a copy of his fruit? So far, it's only been possible to manufacture his own fruit artificially. There's also Caesar's smile fruit method. However, I consider that unacceptable. Yeah, he could he could die a thousand deaths and it couldn't be enough. Damn. Then Vegapunk continues. I'm fairly certain that with unlimited resources, even special types of devil fruits can be recreated. However, I've yet to confirm whether such synthesized fruits can be awakened. So wait, did he answer the question? So you notice that man is currently an inmate impaled down. I'll continue reading. <laughs> I tried my hand at Logius, but they were trickier than expected. There's an alternative for Paramecia types. I found you can synthesize a blood additive from a Paramecia's, for Paramecia user's lineage factor that will grant their power once transfused. That's what you're, that's what you're seeing running through their arms. I call it green blood. So he made... So through green blood, he could copy Paramecia powers. Wow. Then Frankie, you're telling me you created blood? I mean, got the uh, S snake love love. That's sus. Love love Mela and all the agents are like turned to stone. The seraphims are the culmination of my ideas. Then we got the S bear. Rusa shock. Damn, they're piecing all of them up. The peak of what our science can accomplish. They may very well go down. Wow! As the most powerful beings in the history of the sea. Then we got Nami. So that's why the warlord system was abolished. Then we got Usopp. Do you have any idea what you've let loose? And Sanji. So they're basically just navy weapons? Robin. Yes. And they pose a huge threat to us. Kia! Sentamaru, sir. Are you still breathing? Please fall back. Then, no, he Wally coyote Luchi. No, <laughs> Luchi's cracking his neck. He's still good. Sentamaru's coughing up blood. Soro, and he's like charging at Sentamaru. What? Da! <laughs> Luffy has a giant fucking head, and he like smashed right in front of Luchi. Then Luchi straw, straw head, and Luffy tried to bite. Fuck, he tried to eat Luchi. Then Luchi uh, dodges out of the way. Then Luffy's munching on the ground. And he's spitting at all the rocks at Luchi. Pew, 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 pew. Gunshots. So he's shooting uh, all the rocks at Luchi. And Luchi's using arm at hockey to knock him all the way. Then Luffy's bound, bounding on like one of the buildings. It's like, it's like a wrestling rope. Gum, gum, stretch. What? He turned his hair into goggles. Poof. Boing. Booming white rocket. What? He's whooping this man's ass right now. We get the title belt. The big gold belt on Booming white rockets. Jesus Christ. And he just like made like a giant impact into in like Luchi's stomach. Like Luffy shot himself and made like a divot. And Luchi's coughing up blood. Luchi. <laughs> What insane power, Luffy! Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Tell y'all, low, low diff. Stop it! Stop it, Luchi! I'm losing conscious. I'm losing consciousness. I can't hold on. Chopper, ah, hurry this way. Then we got S Snake. The vacuum rocket is wait waiting. Hurry and get on. Jimbe, you have my gratitude. It's nice to see such a kind version of you, Hancock. Then we got S Snake. Y you insolent dummy! I'm just following orders. T minus one minute till takeoff. Then Chopper. 
Hey Luffy, hurry up! Please refrain from trying to board last minute. Then Luchi then said tomorrow, Straw Hat, I'm trusting you with Grandpa Punk. Then uh, Straw and Luffy, you got it. I'll get him off this island, no matter what. Preparing to take off. Whoa, it's so fast. Huh? Where are we? Where's Vegapunk? You've come to stay... You've come to stay calm. We're on the vacuum rocket. Wait. Is that Luffy? Oh, that's Vega... Wait, who's... Is that Luffy? Incredible. And who the hell is this supposed to be? It's a long story. That's Luffy, but let's save the explanation for later. He's all, like, saggy and shit. He just left... So they, they just left him tomorrow behind? The fuck? Yeah! The approximate journey from the uh, Fabrio stratum to the lab stratum ah, is 32 seconds. So Luffy's tongue is out and he's all shriveled up inside the lab. We have reached our destination so quick. All subsequent flights have been cancelled. The frontier dome has been fortified. Intruders have infiltrated beyond high alert. To the lab workers, please remember to barricade the factor, uh, factory shelters properly. You have to find him. Vegapunk couldn't ask for a better bodyguard. This is a real pity, Sensimaru. Is he... He's on a shirt? Luffy could have easily carried him back. What? This is a real pity, Sensimaru. He's just in a pool of his own blood. Then Stussy, our orders are to wait for the Marines. Then Luchi, if you wait too long, they'll get away. Back to the lab. They seriously want you dead? Isn't that a waste for the government? You're the smartest man in the world. And would you and would you rest easy if uh if you thought such an intel intellect may turn against you? Not that I ever intended to do to do so, you mind. Oh yeah, I suppose it would make sense to snuff out a potential liability like you, said Nami. And Usopp, how can he talk about stuffing someone out like that? Then we got Vegapunk. An Emperor's crew sh uh, showing up just as things come to a head. What a serendipitous twist of fate. So you really want to come aboard our ship, said Usopp. Hey, talk about heavy cargo, said Nami. I'm all for it. I'll show you General Frankie and the Sunny. Are you, are you ever going to unbind our feet, to, you see now, geezer? So Luffy's back to normal. Wow, where are we? Quick, Dr. Atlas needs medical attention and repairs. We'll leave her to you. And where are you going, Bonnie? I'm going to make Vegapunk turn my dad back to normal. If he refuses, he's a dead man. Remind me to never make you angry. Blocked off every exit. Roger, there are six Vegapunks left, including the real one. Yeah, but that's the defense system uh, the defense system of theirs. Sure is tough nut to crack. Whew. I don't care. I won't let a single one of those rats scurry off this island. So they have all the command of the uh, uh, Seraphims now. Oh my. So the Straw Hat crew has allied itself with Vegapunk. On paper, that should make for a straightforward escape. But boy, are they in for a surprise if they think it'll be easy. We'll proceed as planned. Get as many warships as possible to to Egghead. The Navy AQ draws near. The Straw Hats are going to be the Buster Call. Let's go! That was the hype chapter. Hype chapter. But Luchi got pieced up. He... he, he he couldn't do it. He's not good enough, as expected. Ain't no shame in that. Uh, you know, happens to the best. Happened to Kaido. Happens to the best of them. So, you know, um, then Luffy turned it on. Luchi had no nothing he could do about it. When Luchi, when Luffy's like, yeah, this fight's over. The fight was over. So that was that was pretty dope. Um, Luffy, I don't know. If the, I guess there was a space issue on the rocket. But if the idea is that Sentomaru controls the Seraphim, you would think you would want to save Sentomaru at least. Questionable intelligence, okay, plot and do stupidity, okay, I get it. Increase the threat. 
the Seraphim needs to help Cypher pull. I get it. Then Kizaru's there. So Kizaru's just chilling somewhere. Uh, so we don't know where he is in relation to uh, to Egghead. Um, but he's... Alright, so we see he might be on the naval ships on this way there. Um, but Kizaru's close. Close by. So within a couple of chapters... So we know Zoro and fucking um, Brooke are on the Sunny. So I'm suspecting that's who Kizaru's going to come across to first. Because they're not inside whatever protected area. So I'm assuming that's where the fight's going to work. Kizaru's going to fight. Zoro versus Kizaru's going to fight. That's what I'm thinking. Um, but but that uh, opening, what, 16 or whatever, when it had Sanji and Kizaru fighting, that shit was dope too. So I don't know, but I think you're right. My, if I had to put money on it, I'm saying it's uh, Zoro and Brooke are going to run into the Marines. So it's going to be Kizaru and probably some big name Marine, Onigumo, Momonga or something. And then to be Zoro and Brooke, we'll have to hold them back for a little bit. Um, and maybe Zoro gets the dub. I, I like. They also introduced those gloves that we could touch light. So I'm, so I'm not sure Who, who's going to fight these. <laughs> like, Frankie could get an upgrade and fight Kizaru for all I know. Like, who knows? Uh, that was a dope chapter of One Piece. Uh, let me know who you think Kizaru's gonna fight in the comments below. Uh, make sure to like the video if you haven't. Peace out. Manga After Dark out.